Hey guys, it's Nelson with Galaxy Note 3 Softmodder, and today I'm going to review an application called Beat, which is a new music application for Android. So, um, you can download it for free on the Play Store. Just head over to the Play Store. Whoa. And there it is. It's called Beat by developer Steven Pletel. Hope I said that correctly. I'm going to open it up and show you some of the cool features that make it uh, worth downloading. So, um, if you tap on here, you can um, search your music through USB storage, and it's packaged by all of the uh, folders on your device. So if you collect music in folders, this can be really useful. So you can go here to Downloads, and everything is in alphabetical order. So here I have um, an album, the Tame Impala album, and there you can view it like this. And it'll pop up like this on your on your uh, in the player. Um, let's see, I'll just press any song to play. Uh, from there, as a, I like the uh, the whole feel to it. It's uh, very minimal. Has at the bottom the controls. Um, one of the cool features is that you can go over here, and go to equalizer, and you can mess with the bass and you can mess with uh, all these other uh, all these other settings to change the sound of the uh, of your music playing. So I uh, put up the the base and I uh, mess with some of these just to see if it's a preference thing and then you can save it also you can go through a list of uh, presets that are already on here so if you go back um, you can also swipe here and you can also this is another setting um, kind of menu here's the equalizer which I uh, went on earlier you can toggle it off and on a visualizer and then the other cool feature is the launch floating controls. So if I tap that, it'll tell me OK. And here's this small circle. Um, if I exit out of here, you can see that the small circle is still there. Um, you can hold down on it. And then you feel it vibrate. And you can put it higher up. And from there, you can play the music. So, and it closes on itself. You can go through any application on your uh, on your device. Uh, it works if you're on Chrome. It works if you're on Twitter. It works if it works if you're on Instagram. And it's cool because you can just toggle your music, uh, change stuff directly from that little uh, widget. And usually, you would need an actual widget. This isn't more of a widget, but more of floating controls. So it's just really useful. And if you want to press X, uh, that exits out of it. And you can also change other settings. It's very customizable. You can change the cover size, uh, list style. There's a lot of colors here to go through. Um, you can change the action bar color, what kind of swipe animation you want when you change from song to song. So I right know. Whoa. If you switch now, it has this kind of cool thing. But you can mess with all that and go through all the settings. So yeah, it's a really cool music player. It's relatively new to the Play Store, and uh, I really enjoy it. All right, well, that's it. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Galaxy Note 3 Softmodder. All right, thanks.